Alright, I'm back. Uh, gate to Limbo here. Um, this is actually... It's always been a favorite of mine, even though it's a big sprawling level. I think it's the the geometry is more interesting than in most Doom levels. Um, I actually killed a couple of enemies before I started recording, uh, and I'm sorry about that. It's actually before I took my little break I, uh, that I mentioned in the last video. <laughs> when you spawn into the level, there's a bunch of enemies shooting you, and so I took care of the problem before I paused. Um, so if you feel cheated, I will happily record this for you again, sirs and madams. But I'm sure you don't care. Uh, I certainly don't, really. Uh, let's see. It's really not much of a profit there, but whatever. Uh, I don't have the key. I don't have the key. Okay. The key, the key. Who's got the key? This level is sprawling. Um, it's just this huge disjointed level uh, full of this green marble. Um, the Doom level designers uh, for episodes episode 3 were very fond of this green marble stuff. I don't know if it says biblically somewhere or something that hell is full of green marble, but apparently it is. One of the things that makes Doom look so primitive compared to newer games um, is actually the 8-bit palette. Um, now, I'm sure a lot of you who are slightly savvy are thinking, but wait a minute, this game isn't 8-bit. Uh, you're correct, it's actually 32-bit. Um, however, uh, that's referring to something completely different. Um, this game uses uh, what's called 8-bit color, uh, which gives you the option of uh, 256 different colors on the screen at once. Um, which, 256 colors is not very much. Um, nowadays, pretty much everything is in 32-bit color, uh, which is 16.7 million colors on screen at once, and that's a lot more colors. Uh, that's what all your 360 and PS3 games run in. Wii games I'm not so sure about. I'm sure they do, though. Uh, I would have to think. A 16-bit color is, is pretty terrible. Uh, although certainly a lot better than this. It's funny, though. You know, and I, I, I'm sorry, Wii owners. Uh, Wii fanboys. I don't mean to knock on your system just for the sake of knocking on your system. But I actually find this more pleasing to look at than a lot of Wii games. And I think that's more a design thing. Um, obviously, than a technology thing. Uh, I mean, obviously, the Wii is much more advanced than this game. Uh, even even this version of this game that I'm running, uh, in some ways, the Wii is a lot more advanced. Um, but it, it's just I think it's the uh, design choices that Wii game developers make. Uh, everything seems to be very bright and colorful and and pastel. I think it's the use of pastels. I really hate pastels. I've actually never seen anything done in pastels I liked. All those. Oh, you know what? The blue key doors are over here. I actually saw them earlier. I always forget how to play this level, even though I've, like, as I mentioned, it's one of my favorites. I have the mind of, I don't know, a dog. Hey! Hit that switch, drops that, there's that guy. What are you doing? That. I don't have the red key yet, so we're gonna just leave. When Brutal Legend came out, a couple of my friends and I had a discussion about uh, metal games uh, and what games were metal, and I nominated Doom as a metal game, and got caught some resistance on that uh, on that front. I was kind of surprised. But, uh, Doom is very metal, I think. Uh, I mean, there's demons everywhere, and all these references to Satan, and, and, um, it's a struggle, you know, which metal is always about the struggle, uh, which is kind of ridiculous, but it is. Um, no, it's not. <coughs> Excuse me. Goodness. Um, <laughs> it's not good at all. I need to not be here. Um, 
I'm still a little sick, so I apologize. Which it's really frustrating to me. I I didn't even want a flu shot, uh, and then I was it was mandated by the people where I live that I get one, uh, and they gave me the money for it, so it wasn't that bad. But um, <laughs> I wasn't I really wasn't sick uh, until I got the flu shot, and then I got the flu shot, and now I have been ill for like well since I got it, which was like a week ago. I'm not I mean, I'm not like I don't really feel that bad, but it's just. You know, I'm sick. I mean, I got sniffles and head stuffed up, throat hurts a little bit. I haven't been taking anything, which uh, probably forfeits any right I have to complain about it, but um, I don't know. It's still annoying. It's like, you take a shot so you don't get sick, and you get sick. To me, what's wrong with this picture? Excuse me. I actually had dinner earlier, uh, and uh, whenever I took my little break, and uh, it was uh, quite delicious. Steak and potatoes, had some salad. The salad wasn't especially good, but it uh, wasn't bad. I don't know why I'm telling you about my dinner. I have nothing else to talk about, really. <laughs> this right here was one of the things I liked about Doom. Uh, you know, as I mentioned before, or about this level, I mean, uh, I should say, this right here is one of the things I liked about this level, but uh, as I mentioned before, Doom is not a 3D game. Uh, it rendered graphics that appear to be in 3D, but it actually cannot create a 3D environment, um, because the map data is stored as a 2D, you know, as a 2D level. Uh, it's a height map, is what it is. So, um, you know, most of the game is pretty obviously 2D, uh, pretty flat. Particularly the original Doom game. Uh, Doom 2 gets a lot better about that. Uh, Doom 2 and also all the later Doom games. But, um, anyway. I, uh, I really enjoyed, whenever I was younger, uh, things in Doom that made Doom seem more 3D. And... Is this where the... Yeah, that's where it is. Okay. So this is where I don't need to be. I need to be over there. Um, and this area was always among the things that made Doom seem more 3D. I think I can actually run from here over to there. Yep. I'm actually pretty sure that's how you get here. And that drops me here. Oh, well, clearly not. Whatever the case. I'm actually gonna go down here, pick up a health kit or two. A uh, med kit, sorry. Go down here, grab a, a suit. Uh, is it this way? It is this way. Uh, it's actually over here. I'll grab another one just for to, just for to refresh my time. Over here in this teleporter. Oops, didn't bring you back here. Uh, I actually need to go around this way. Did I go in here already? I don't remember. No. Yes. Dicks. That's fantastic. Um, now I just need to remember how to get back to the middle. Uh, right there. This level always takes me forever. All this teleporting nonsense. This is, yeah, that. So that's either side of it, um, and that's that. Which means it pretty much has to be. Uh, where does this go? This is the, yeah, this is the inside, far side. So it's got to be over here. Is it the one back here? Maybe the one back here. Yep, that's it. Okay.
negate the limbo first. And perfect it, even. Although I took a lot of damage I didn't need to, but that's okay. And the next level is Dis, the last level. 